Do you believe that he can save you completely? <laughs> or are you struggling with the idea that Yeshua can save you a little bit? Like he, he did a pretty good job of saving you, but he didn't, he didn't really go all the way. Because if you believe that Yeshua can save you completely, then he can heal you completely. He can set you free completely. The enemy is the one trying to trick you into thinking that Yeshua can't do those things. And tonight I say we, we decide as a corporate community, that's enough. That we don't go any further holding the hand of the wrong image of God that Satan's painting. We let go of that tonight. We don't look at that view anymore. John 8, 36, so if the Son sets you free, you will be free indeed. Amen. Last verse, Galatians 5, verse 1, it is for freedom that the Messiah has set us free. Now stand firm then, and do not let yourselves be burdened again by the yoke of slavery. It's like, it's like the Lord has already healed and set us free and saved us and purchased us, but we just keep reminding Him that we were in prison. Like, God, I know you did, but I was, I was lost. Yeah, but you're not now, but I was lost. Yeah, but you're not lost now, but I was hurt. Yeah, but you're healed now. Yeah, yeah, but I'm hurt. But you're not hurt anymore, but I was hurt. But you're not anymore. Because if the Son sets you free, then you're free. And if He's healed you, then you're healed. It's time you tell the devil, I'm not listening to you anymore. I'm out of your schemes. I will settle my past. Because whatever they did for me in the past, whoever hurt me, it no longer defines my future. So what will you decide to do tonight? We know that God brings healing. He's the only one that can do that. We want him to get all the glory. He's the only one that brings healing, but it appears we do have a role in the process. <coughs> Tell the doctor what you need so that he can heal you. Can you stand with me? Hallelujah. Hallelujah, that's good stuff. Hallelujah. We're going to invite our prayer team forward. Prayer team, if you're going to make your way down quickly. We're going to open up the altars for prayer ministry as we continue in worship tonight. But before we do that, let's just say a corporate prayer to the Lord. If you're comfortable with your hands up or in a receiving position, and you can feel free to do it out if you want. You can, you can do the arm stretched out version. You can do the really wide version if you want. You might even do the waiting version. I don't care which version you do. You might even do this one right here. Give me a little gift, God, right here in my hand. I heard someone say one time that there's another version. It's like the carrying a big flat TV, uh, flat screen TV version, right here. <laughs> it's okay. You made in the image of God. God made laughter. Laughter heals. Father, in the name of Yeshua, we say thank you for your word. Thank you that it reminds us of who you really are. We see past the schemes and the lies of the evil one. We see past the false pictures that he wants to paint for us. Father, we forgive. We decide tonight to forgive those people who hurt us. We let go of bitterness. We don't want it anymore. We thank you that you gave us the keys to prison, that we got out, that you've set us free all the way. We pray for emotional scarring in the room that will be healed tonight. We pray for abuse that is healed tonight. Abandonment that is healed tonight in the name of Yeshua. We pray for physical needs as well that you would be healed tonight in your body, in your mind. Thank you, Lord, that you alone have the healing touch. And we are saying yes tonight that we want it. We're not pretending we don't need it. We are saying out loud, God. There is something wrong with us, and we need you. We 
We are sick and we need the doctor. We are hurt and we need the physician tonight. And we're not afraid to say that. And in faith, we know that you will provide the healing. Please come down, receive prayer from our prayer team. While we worship, we'll close the service in just a few minutes.
for the future. Peace for the presence. Thank you, God. You're redeeming our past. Let's sing together. You're perfect in all of your ways to us, God. And we worship you.